So there are fundamental assumptions uh, that we've made around work and the way that workplace, uh, workplaces are, are constructed that are changing underneath our feet right now. And what we're still seeing is the, is the world uh, digesting the concept of work as being a completely mobile activity. One of the assumptions about work that's changing is you know, compensation used to be about cash comp and benefits. And now quality of life at work is a third leg of that stool that is changing a lot of things. I think human-centered design for us as an organization, for I think me as an individual, and I'm sure Chris would say the same thing, it really changed the way that we thought about problems and how you think about designing solutions and or products to solve problems. And I think one of the things that human-centered design did for us was it, it put not the customer, but the individual human at the center of literally everything that we do. So I'd love to share something. So I just came from working with my team. And for us, it's really about acting with intention. And so people talk about getting coffee in the morning, right? And what we were just able to understand, particularly for London, is that there are two types of things that we want to satisfy now. In our coffee shops, we want every customer to feel like the regular, for them to be known when they walked in, to be greeted by name. But then there's also the coffee that you have upstairs and when you get to your office and the rituals that are attached to having that coffee. And so how does someone come in, start their day, and how do we create the places within our workspace for those rituals to occur naturally. We have a design principle here that is think global, act local. And so we don't want to become like a Starbucks or a Marriott where wherever you go, it's exactly the same. We want to be very true to a local aesthetic, a local look and feel, and frankly, also what's hip and cool. I think that the essence of a brand is really about what can your customers consistently expect out of your company and how do you make them feel. But the things that stay the same across our entire portfolio is you know, genuine hospitality, attention to detail, and people who care. And these are universal and I think those are things that will never change because in a fast changing digital world, I think that there's a premium on human experience that's more than there ever has been before. The power that place can have in bringing humans together, I think, is not just core to the vision, but core to the ethos. And again, something that no matter where in the world I am, that's just what Convene is in the business of doing. And you know, I think the power of place is oftentimes very understated. Right? And place isn't just the physical, it's how do I feel when somebody greets me? What's the food experience like? It's all of those things, uh, you know, I think, coming together to bring what we think is a differentiated experience here at Convene to life.